Uh, but this is a DJ Reeman with the Cinematic Popcorn Request Show, and I'm speaking to Dirk Weaver of uh, Mr. Uh, yeah, hello there, Dirk. How are you? Um, I'm pretty good. I'm pretty good. How about you? Uh, not too bad. After trying uh, to scuffle around, yes, he's trying to reorganise interviews. <laughs> But uh, let's, let's go straight to the track you chose uh, from your album. And uh, uh, tell us a bit about Monsoon, what you chose off your album, uh, Shatter. Uh, Monsoon is a, it's it's different than a lot of our other stuff. I mean, we try to uh, broach the, the spectrum of music, try to go from one genre to the next to the next. Yeah. Um, Monsoon is, is a an upbeat, kind of almost like a heavier track. Okay. Um, <clears throat> It almost goes into the kind of the rock, almost metal category. All right. In some ways, so we try to make our music as diverse as the six of us are. Uh, but this is a DJ Reeman with the Cinematic Popcorn Request Show, and I'm speaking to Dirt Weaver of uh, Mystic Fire. Are you actually like uh, the, the spokesman of the band, or? Um, I'm the one that does all the booking. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. our our creative process is a is completely democratic everybody gets involved so okay. um but I, I tend to do more of the more of the meeting and greeting than, than anybody else does right. so, but thanks for listening by the way on monday that was pretty cool oh of course yeah i really i really like the 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 script you're playing oh yeah definitely thank you very much but this is uh, uh for mystic far off the album shatter current cd baby because i actually wondered where it was you said uh itunes and i thought well there must be something else and i just checked and it's cd baby <laughs> Yeah, well, it's on um, it's on CD Baby, iTunes, Amazon, yeah. um, pretty much every everywhere you can get music digitally, you can find us. Oh. Um, and that was uh, that was recorded locally here in Virginia. Oh, cool. Um, cool, cool. It, we're we're much better live because you can feel the energy of the music. Yeah. But but the recording came out really really good. I'm really proud of it. Cool. Uh, well, this is one of the Mrs. Monsoon on Music World Radio. I work. <laughs>
the uh, I take it this is not the first time you released an album. Um, it's our first full studio album. We oh, did okay. a we did an album that um we recorded ourselves. Yeah. Um, yeah. In, our, in our home studio, but this was the first one we actually took the time, went into a professional studio, and yeah. and did it that way. Yeah. Because uh, of uh, you said be going some time. I take it that means that uh, uh, is this. Is it mainly because you just prefer performing live in front of a lot of people, like doing a lot of gigs and stuff? And that, is that the reason you were? Is it the is that the reason for the first uh, studio, studio album? Yeah, we we love performing live. Yeah, I mean that's that's really where we hit our stride. Yeah, um, the, the style of music we do is really conducive to a live audience. Yeah. Um, what um, what what made you uh, what made you decide to record an album then after so long? Uh, obviously that um, you know some people. Mm-hmm. Have, do uh, an album for a reason, you know. Or either they start doing loads of albums and gig an album and gig like a lot of people do. Um, but why did you uh, leave it to? Or did do you get a lot of people ask for one? One thing, and we had a lot of people who wanted to take the music that they heard yeah. at the shows. They yeah. wanted to take it home with them. Yeah. So, yeah. so it was it was a lot of uh, audience and fan demand that yeah. we released something that they could actually take with them, put in their cars. I mean. Having those drums in your car as you're driving down the road is definitely, definitely a, a, an awesome feeling. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> well, it's definitely very different. Um, you know, we've had like acoustics and metal and stuff, a lot of metal and from America, and uh, uh, but you know, it's nice to hear uh, other than like ambient and pop and that electro we get uh, for, for the chart, of course. And uh, it's very nice to hear something different and tribally, anyway. Yeah, that's what I mean. We wanted to make music that is representative of the six of us, and yeah. and one of our strengths will play stuff that you will not hear most places. Yeah, and and when you hear another song of ours, it's not going to sound like any of our other songs. No. So it's it's something we try to. It really is something for everybody. But uh, yeah, thank you very much for uh, coming on. Uh, yeah. uh, spur of the moment. <laughs> Oh no problem. I'm just I'm glad for the exposure. Glad glad to get people to listen to us. That's that's really our main focus is to get is to get as many ears on our music as possible. 